Hey, what's up guys? Hey, here bringing you another tutorial, and this tutorial will be on how to use oil paint. Uh, I got a couple requests on how to do this, so I thought I would do a tutorial on it. Now, right off the bat, I'd like to um, explain that some computers, um, when you have Photoshop, some of the settings to use some of these features in Photoshop are unchecked. Uh, I don't know why, just sometimes it does that to computers, which for the longest time mine was like that until I figured out how to fix it. So first what you want to do is you want to go into edit and you want to go into preferences and then you want to go to general. And then once you're here, you want to go to performance and then you want to check use graphic graphics processor. Now this will allow you to use oil paint if it was if it has some kind of error just check this and everything will be fine so once you do that I'm just gonna show you uh, some cool little things you could do with oil paint so I'm just gonna duplicate this because I might do a couple other things maybe not but you want to go into oil paint right here in uh, filter and you will go oil paint and as you can see it already makes this cool little effect but I'm gonna explain what some of these settings do now as you can see right off the bat stylization it kind of makes it more focused you could say in a, some way like the if I have it far right it's gonna be all really blurry and it's gonna hard it's hard to tell what the actual image is but if I slowly move it to the less or uh, to the left you could see more and more focus go into the image now you can mess with this Personally, I don't like it all the way to the left or to the right. I kind of like it towards like the right here. This will work uh, 1.98. Um, this is a nice little area to have it. It looks cool, but uh, that's this is for this image. So I guess you want to experiment with this um, uh, bristle detail. This doesn't really do that much. I mean, it has a little little detail, but I wouldn't really mess with it. Uh, cleanliness like if I put it all the way to the right it's gonna be like really nice and clean and it's not gonna be so rough on the uh, oil paint effect here like if I put it all the way to the left you're gonna notice it's really rough and if I put it to the, all the way to the right you're gonna notice it's smoother and all sorts of stuff like that um, I kind of I tor I like it towards I guess you could say the left side a little bit more not just my personal opinion but also it's a uh, on the image you kind of want to edit it to uh, your liking and then as you can see here um, scale is like usually scales how big or how small you want it so you can edit like how big each uh, little indent is or you could have it like super super small so then there's tons of indents this one I don't really have a personal preference I mean it's really up to the image lighting um this as you can see it kind of like it's rotating it a little bit it's changing the uh, curves a little uh, i'd mess with this a little bit and then shine um i really wouldn't mess with this due to the fact that i mean if this is your style yeah you could do something cool with this but you'd have to be really creative so i mean i usually like to have it kind of like a little bit not too much like if I have it all the way off, you're gonna notice there's no uh, no uh, little ripples and such. Which this is actually a pretty cool effect as well. As you can see, like everything's all oil painted, but it's there's no like ripples, which can actually be very useful. If that's like you could do a lot of cool things with this. So just like I turn it up a little bit, turn it down. I mean, it's really all up to you. Personally, I like it lower sometimes not even at all but for this case I'll just have it really really low um sorry this guy this one was a quick tutorial um I'd, I need some feedback on what to do next I'm kinda running low on some things I need some feedback on what I could teach you guys next I have a couple ideas for next week but hope you enjoyed this tutorial if you wanna stay up to date with us follow us on Twitter or check out our website to apply for our team or a moderator or a substitute for the tutorial channel and hope you enjoyed this tutorial guys and I'm out